Thank you so much for tuning in. So today I have my daughter to be my hair model for me because I want to do a prom inspired hairstyle and her hair is nice and long for me to do this look for you guys. So since grad and prom season is coming up, I thought that I would share this super cute and easy hairstyle that you guys can try for yourself or do it on a friend, you know, if you guys want to save a little bit of money, you know, because it's always nice to save money when it comes to that time of the year. So if you guys are ready to see how I did this look, then just keep on watching. First thing I'm going to do is add some volume to the hair. So I'm just going to be doing some back combing to this area just to give it a bit of a poof. Then I'm just going to spray a bit of hairspray to the teased area just to firm it up a bit. Then I'm just going to take up another section and do the same thing. After that, I'm just going to bring down the hair and lightly smooth out the area. Just making sure not to brush out all the back combing. Now to start off with the style. I'm going to take a section from both sides of the head like so. And then bring it together in the middle and tie that off with a rubber band. And then I'm going to take another section from both sides of the head again and bring the two sections together but this time I'm bringing it off to the right side. And then I'm going to secure that with a rubber hair tie. So basically, I'm just going to be repeating the same technique down the hair, just making sure to alternate each side of the ponytail. This is basically how I'm going to be doing this hairstyle. I'm just going to be tying the hair in a zigzag style. So if I'm tying it to the left with one section, the next section I will be tying it over to the right side.
when I get to about this far down the hair, I'm just going to do a regular three strand braid all the way down. And now I'm just going to pull on the hair to give the style a little more fullness, making sure all the hair ties are covered. Now with the tail of the braid, I'm just going to tuck it under and secure that with a bobby pin. And that's pretty much it. This look is so super easy and very cute. And I can't wait till my hair is long enough to try this look out for myself. And with this look, you can also accessorize it with some fancy hair pieces and place it in this area over here. And if you have a hair tie like I do showing, you can also take a little hair jewel and clip it on top of that to disguise it. And that's it for this look. Thanks for watching. Bye.